tonight, and what I'm going to do is tell you first off, welcome to Katie's Wacky World with Crazy Cameron today, and we also have a guest star for the second time in a row, Dan Hunter. He's a quarterback for Riverview School. He's here to interview with Cameron. He's going, they're going to do a back and forth question and answer type thing, and also we're going to show you a reel of his highlights. So, and then we have a third part, which is going to be other stuff that we weren't able to include on both of these videos, but we really appreciate him coming out there. He was a great sport about everything that we did. He, he did the slime. He did everything. He did uh, several more things. We do a sour challenge and we have that on the next video, but this one is just going to be about talking with him about football and also talking with him about, you know, uh, just, you know, what it's like to be, you know, quarterback and him in general. And then Cameron gets some questions also. And then on top of that, we're going to show you his highlight reel that he has, which is really awesome. He's going to show you what an amazing athlete he is. He's only in 10th grade. So I think in the next couple of years, he's going to be the guy to watch. Anyway, we're very glad to be able to have had him at our house. And we have him in upcoming videos too. So thank you for coming out and enjoy this video, guys. Quarterback for Riverview. It's fun when you're winning. But once you lose, everybody doesn't like you anymore. Yeah. Sucks. Worst injury. How about that? Ask him about his worst injury. Worst injury. Broken ribs, probably, yeah. How, how did that happen? Yeah, how did that happen? I was, I was running the ball, and I broke a few tackles, and I thought I was going to score. But the kid came from the side and tackled me, and I like flipped. Ooh. Oh, that had to hurt. Yeah. Uh, yeah, football players are tough, man. I'm glad that I'm not in it. How many touchdowns did you have this year? I mean, did you have any personal touchdowns that you threw or ran yeah. in? I threw a 62-yard pass for a touchdown. I think I saw that on Facebook, actually. Yeah, that was I, awesome. I ran the, the two-yard one for varsity. And I have, like, nice. I have seven or eight for JV. Very good. Yeah, very good. A 20 yard touchdown for Jamie yeah. and maybe a 60 one and 50 yard line and run away. So, what does it feel like to be this awesome? I can't even describe it. Right? It's, too it's hard. It's, it's hard really to put is. into words. I mean, you I just. Know I'm you walk out there and you just know. Really? You're just stop. a man. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, you. Oh, we're done, I guess, for a minute. All right, go ahead. Now Cameron is going to get a little interviewed by Gannon. We're going to kind of switch it up a little bit. Go ahead, Gannon. All right. Have you ever scored any touchdowns playing football? Yep. How scored many? three in one game. That's it. I scored four in one game one time. Well, my whole my whole season was about ten touchdowns. That was good. That's pretty good. I got two. I got two interceptions. One was a pick six. And the other one was about 10 yard gain. Not bad. Yeah. Oh, uh. I don't know. How about this? Ask him how many girlfriends he's had this year. How many girlfriends have you had? Uh, <laughs> about 15, 20. And he's not lying. He has a different one every other day. Uh, yeah. And I've met them. I actually know they exist. I want to say one on You're camera. Player, can we? He does. He comes up every other day. Cam? No, don't, don't. He has one that he really likes that. I'm dating right now. That. Oh. Nope. Not really. You you are on I camera. Really, really, really like. But one that I'm dating. Yes, and you know who you are. We all know who you are. Uh huh. But and there's been lots of girls in between. Yeah. How about you? I you went to the homecoming. Did you have fun? Did you guys go as friends or? Yeah, we went as friends. It was, it was fun. It's funner to go as friends. I always enjoyed that. Who was it? Don't don't say because I don't know if she wants her name on this. So let's just not say that right now. Okay. I'm gonna flip this. Chair she's pretty over. though. You did good. Yeah. I mean she's she's not you know my my hi? friend's child which I I love but you know. She, she's in Virginia, so I couldn't take her. Bring her back. Bring her back, Gannon. So, how does that uh? Have you gotten uh, a lot of uh, more girl attention since you become quarterback? Maybe? No? Yeah. No, it's not like the movies. I know, right? It's, it's not like that, you know, varsity you high or whatever. Um, Mom, what is it? Have, have, have blues. Ever... Varsity blues. Yeah, how many girlfriends have you had? This year, like, you know. Last year. Uh, I think one. 
See, he's at the age where he's taking um, that he's actually dating someone a little bit more serious than. I'm someone for about two years. His his oh, problem is he always wants to trade up. He, he he wants literally he wants a girlfriend so bad like that's all he can think about is that one girl he wants her he talks about her he talks about her wants her wants her wants her wants her as soon as he gets her he's like oh well okay yeah. I want another one and then he'll break up with, I mean he'll go on and on and on about love blah, 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 and then he gets that girl and he's like hmm I want that one now he's dated some he you dated over the summer a, a girl going into seventh grade that is probably as tall as Gannon really? I mean it was crazy really pretty too and. That's so, pretty tall. He does. But I, I said, you won't have any if you don't learn to treat for a long term if you don't treat them better. That's the thing. You got to treat them like they are important. I'm trying to teach them how to be a good. You hear this, girls. Just saying, if you're watching this and you're Cameron's girlfriend, just pay attention to the signs. Oh, Katie's right there, too. Yeah, most of them are. Just maybe one or two aren't. Trying to see so, what is in the camera. Is it? Do you like having the? Do you like the new coach? Has that been a good change? Yeah, yeah. yeah I like mm -hmm. it a lot. Okay, that's awesome. It's always good to like your Four coach. Mean. Well, he wasn't a good fit. Let's put it that way. So they uh, they switch coaches this year. Gannon is in tenth grade. So and next year, do you guys have a young team like or because I know you guys had a lot of seniors that went up. Do you have a lot of people that like the? The better positions are they uh, played by uh, there, un there, underclassmen? There's some, be there, isn't there some good kids down in university or something? Yeah. University there's, there's university. Is there some better ones than? Yeah. Mom, we should have I done the Skittles, huh? I can't put them in. Yeah. Coach you, John. Yeah, and it's all on what he decides what's going to fit for that game and, and stuff like that. So that's his decision, and we it's, don't know why. It's mostly about the size and how strong you are. Well, I think it's also on, on what how you're going to fit in that game against that next team and how you're going to play. And Well, it, it's mostly about the size. Well, it's all how hard you work, really. Yeah. Yep, I think that that's and awesome. And some about the size. If you're, like, short like me going against him, oh, you're going to get shot. Yeah, well, I don't know. Joey does pretty good. Joey, you know Joey. Joey Gray. He does really good yeah. for a little guy. He's fast. He, we were playing football, and he threw it so hard that it hurt my nail. He, he's real little. Have you met him? Yeah. Cody's brother? He's like two, maybe my, like, he's maybe two, like, here? No, he's, he's real little. Yeah. We pushed him. We put him in a I locker so last year. We were playing around. Thing. I wanted some pictures of him. We he he was laughing. So yeah, he's about. about I don't want to make. He's him real skinny. He's a real little guy. He's fast though. He's real good he's fast. Not fast. I mean. He, he so I shout out Joey. Fast. We love you. Yeah. Yeah. I'm faster than you. So which? Wait, one more question. Okay. You you for play different sports, you. don't you? Yeah, what sports do you play? I play football and baseball. I thought so. Which one do you like better? If, if you were going to make a career out of it, which one would you choose to start out? Baseball. I always like baseball more, too. Yeah. I, I like just wondered. More. I mean, I, I'm not like a guy, you, but... I like, the yeah. truck. I like to hit people. Yeah? I like to hit people. You like to hit people? That's the only thing I like about football. It's hitting someone. It is pretty fun. It is. All but, right. Well, when it hurts, I kind of feel bad. Well, nobody likes to hurt somebody, well, hurt, I, hurt them. Kind of. When I, like, break someone, oh, yeah. I kind of feel bad. I mean, unless you're watching on TV and then you're yelling yeah, at the TV, I, you know. Yeah. Sorry. Oh, I say, oh, God, that I don't know. <laughs> I get pretty violent when I watch, uh, especially college sports. It's, get them, get them, get them. <laughs> you know, it's a good time. Uh -huh. I, I don't watch them as much anymore. It just makes me too nervous. All right, guys, this is the it for the interview of Mr. Ow, Gannon, that was right? Sour. What? It wasn't very sour. No. There was two. There was one that got me. One or two that got me. Yeah, we got to get... Yeah, right, guys. I thought he sour for yeah, If you guys sour. are watching this and you have any ideas, hashtag us some uh, sour ideas. Otherwise, I'm just going to go on Google and we're going to find the sourest candy possible for the no, next sour no. challenge. No. All right, guys. Okay, thank okay. next, um, this coming, I'm watching Katie's <laughs> The Scary Night. Yeah. I'm at 3 in the morning. No! Uh.